Tenochtitlan, Mexico, heart of the Aztec Empire. 28 years after Columbus, the lust for gold is about to change the destiny of the New World. Through the ambitions of one man, Hernan Cortez. Devious, charming, and ruthless. Leading a band of just 500 European adventurers. Cortez was quite a manipulator and quite savvy. He knows how to motivate people, and the objective is gold, and that's what, of course, was the prime motivation. Aztec Emperor Montezuma, the richest, most powerful man in the Americas, ruler of 25 million people. He's welcomed Cortez and his men into his palace. A mistake that will change the fate of a continent. Their numbers were small. How could they constitute a threat when you have an army that's a thousand times, ten thousand times larger than the few hundred souls that they brought, right? Cortez's plan? <laughs> Kidnap the emperor. Part of his calculation was, if we can show that we can take over at this level, you know, incarcerate um, the head of the empire, maybe the rest of the dominoes will fall. Montezuma's treasuries are filled with gold. The Spanish lust for plunder astonishes the Aztecs. An eyewitness reports they snatched up the gold like monkeys. They were swollen with greed. They hungered for that gold like wild pigs. The people dubbed their captive emperor Cortez's whore and revolt. Trapped inside the palace, Cortez receives word from his men. We're in imminent danger. We'll all perish unless Montezuma commands the hostilities to stop. These strangers are my guests. Lay down your arms. most powerful ruler in the Americas, murdered by his own people. Hey, 
Fighting for their lives, Cortez and his men barely escape with a fortune in Aztec gold and silver. Aye, aye, aye. And leave behind a lethal time bomb. The Conquistadors are going to war with the Aztecs. But their biggest weapons aren't the ones they're carrying in their hands. It's the virus in their bodies. Smallpox. Unbeknownst to them, they bring it to battle. Six months later, half the city is dead from smallpox. Eleven months after his escape, Cortez returns. His victory complete. He's hijacked the mighty Aztec Empire. An empire of 25 million brought down by just 500 men. The quest for luxuries and power 